In this chapter, we will learn how to communicate between Revit and Rhino. McNeil team developed a plugin called Rhino Insight, which is the topic of this chapter. We are going to shortly have an overview of how to use Rhino Insight Revit plugin to bring our Revit project into Rhino and Rhino project into Revit file. If you go to their website, official website is rhino3d.com slash inside slash revit slash 1.0 slash and you see the latest version is here available for you to download. The developers are still working on development of this plugin, but anytime that you check the website, you will access to the latest version and notice that this version works for the latest version of Rhino or Rhino 7 right now. When you click on this download button, you will go to this website, give your email and it will be ready for you to download. When the project is downloaded, double click on this and go to next, Right now, since I have the plugin already installed, it will ask me to repair or remove it. But for you, if this is the first time you are installing the plugin, you will have access to the next button and make sure that you go to the next step and finish the installation. As soon as you finish this installation, then you need to close it and open your Revit file. Right now, I say cancel but you go to the end of the installation and click on finish. And when you open your Revit file, you will see this tab, Rhino Inside, which has these set of tools for you. Let's start working with Rhino Inside Revit plugin. 